Shorty, I need a favor. I need you to get some of your boys to steal something from me. There's a wolf about the He's screaming, take your skin off. I never been there so much people. I never been there so much people. He says, my love is a black dog. He's never seen one of them. But I saw one flying once and told him the night like a lion. Now I know what I know and I know I'm worth every dollar, every cent that God ever spent on a human on rent. If I'm gonna die, I'm gonna live I'm gonna live till then My heart is a big, my heart, mine My heart is a big, my heart My heart is a big, my heart, mine My heart is a big, my heart, Do you know a dude named Lamont? Oh, Lamont B. Steptoe and the White Rabbit Press. Yeah, sure. He, uh, he ran that press back in the 80s. Stein, Stern, Steptoe. Here we are. Uncle South China Sea Blue Nightmare, Oracular Rumbles and Still Walking. You know, I think you should talk to the poets that he published. Back in the 80s, huh? A lot of them were Lower East Side poets, and you know what that means. Hmm. They're still here on the Lower East Side. <laughs> You know of a dude named Lamont B. Steptoe? Yeah, I know that bastard. He published a book of mine and he never paid me. You know where I could find him? He used to keep a stash of his books in the basement at St. Mark's Church. Yeah, that's all I got. Lamont Steptoe, he believed in me. He published uh, my first book and he promised to publish my next one. Yeah, do you know how I could talk to him? No, uh, Lamont don't really roll like that. He doesn't want anybody to blow up his spot. All right, can you get a message to him for me? Yeah, I could do that for a fellow bike messenger. All right, let him know that John Sands will be at St. Mark's Church later today. Okay, no problem. You got yeah, it. Thanks, bro. Yeah. Lamont, it's Mary Alice. I do remember one thing, when Claire crashed with me on Roosevelt Island, when she got in a fight with her lover on the tram one night. We have a chance to set things right by Claire. Well, her poems have a chance to live even if she didn't. Yeah, Lamont, I need to talk to you. Just don't stick me around, all right? Give me a call. Thanks for being here. Oh, you mean here like this graveyard? <laughs> I'm here like getting robbed with you in a parade? <laughs> or like, here like... Like, like here. No, I don't. I came to finish with Claire started. What does that mean? What does that even mean? Yo, that's it? You know who did it and that's it? There's a wolf on the back porch. He 
be screaming, take your clothes off. I've never been in so much pain. I've never been in so much pain. He says, my love is a black dog. He never seen one of them, but I saw one flying once or twice through the night like a lion. Lo, there is an island where the cuckoo vanished from sight. I see you still know your basho. Why are you dragging me all the way out here, Lamont? Claire was an archivist, and she archived her murderer. Yeah, and then she killed herself. No. Yes. No, she had a lover who was stalking and breaking her. And like any good poet, she unconsciously wrote about what was happening. Lamont, you're reading a whole bunch of garbage into her death, okay? You got the manuscript? I thought the manuscript would point back to me uh -huh. and my anarchist activities. But I was wrong, man. Okay. So where is it? The kid got it. The fuck is wrong with you, Lamont? Mark, don't you understand that Claire deserved a better ending? Mark, were you Claire's lover? You know, man, I have always hated that fucking expression, lover. <laughs> There's a wolf on the back porch. He's screaming, take your clothes off. I've never been in so 